Suppose you could go back in time and see how your city looked a few decades ago. More, imagine you could zoom in on the polar ice caps and could see the effects of climate change unfold before your eyes. Isn't that science fiction? Well, Google just made it by unleashing a series of great changes to Google Maps and Google Earth. This is powered with powerful artificial intelligence. These new capabilities will, in addition to this revolution in how we explore the world, revolutionize how we study it in all sectors from urban planning through researches on environments and day-to-day -day navigation. Perhaps you can elaborate on the details of these updates that have granted such a dramatic enhancement in functionality. As we proceed further into our topic today, let's explore how Google is changing the nature in which we interact with the world. What would your neighborhood have looked like in the 1930s? That is the question of the time machine feature. Berlin before World War II or Paris through the eyes of a person who lived in the 1930s. What would you do if you had the chance to take a walk there? Now is the time of the novelty time machine. This website, using nearly eight decades of historical images, gives users a glimpse into some of the world's most famous cities through changes over time. A tool called Time Machine lets users travel back in time and virtually review aerial and satellite photographs going all the way back to the 1930s. This is also present in cities like Berlin, London, Paris, and Warsaw, Poland. When San Francisco was not a place of technology, you might wonder what it could have looked like. It's come a long way from a shoddy shipping port to the vibrant city it is today in its history. This characteristic is not only useful in satiating curiosity, but also has crucial implications for urban planners, researchers, and environmentalists. For example, a better understanding of the means through which human activities have already been affecting natural landscapes or analyzing the evolution of the last decades in the city's infrastructure can significantly provide insights into the planning of the future. Have you ever thought about the changes of landscapes that you face every day? With a few clicks, you can witness the changes taking place in the landmark that you know or in your neighborhood, whichever and whichever attracts you more. Whether you're an aficionado of history, urban growth, or even climate science, this book is a veritable treasure trove. A global snapshot of environmental change from a time-lapse perspective. How many times over the last few decades have you wished that you might zoom out and see how the entire globe has changed? Google does precisely that with millions of satellite photographs forming the new time-lapse feature. It provides a seamless time-lapse view of changes that have taken place in the environment and the geography. You will trace the usually unseen processes that have changed our globe with time-lapse, from tracing urban rises to visualizing deforestation and coastal erosion. How much of the Amazon rainforest has been lost over the past half-century? What effects has global warming had on the polar ice caps? What's fascinating is the history of environmental changes, which can be captured with the help of time-lapse photography, the technique, using which these large-scale transitions can be vividly seen in real time. Instead of strictly falling into the category of environmentalists or policymaking activities, anyone interested in getting a better view of what influences their world could benefit greatly from such a feature. For anyone working in the fields of climate research, conservation, or geography, time-lapse is really useful. Just imagine having access to a tremendous amount of data that stretches for millions of years and wherein you are able to view the picture of how natural disasters and human activities have changed the landscape. These researchers who require an image and a time record of environmental change have taken a huge leap forward with this creation. How does artificial intelligence AI, impact real-time satellite imagery when clouds are no longer an issue? Ever wonder looking at a location on Google Earth and trying to view it, only to find out that the clouds would get in the way? With the Cloud Score plus AI technology having been introduced, this no longer becomes an issue. Google has used AI trained on millions of images to eliminate visual obstacles such as clouds, fog, and haze that has made the satellite photography clearer and brighter than ever. The process prevents interference by the weather, meanwhile holding on to significant natural features of mountains, shadows, ice caps, and snow. Whichever it is, whether researching changes that happen in the environment or basically navigating the world from your screen, higher quality photos such as these will change the game. Imagine that you are a research scientist observing climate change impacts on an environment. You may not draw an accurate conclusion in case you cannot see the features of utmost importance because of the cloud. Removing such problems, Cloud Score plus AI produces a more accurate and consistent dataset. This would be quite a valuable addition for those professionals who rely on accurate, up-to-date geographic information in order to conduct their research and planning. Can you now surf the net and virtually visit some of the planet's most remote locations? Street View has expanded its scope. The sandy mountains of Namibia and the ancient villages of Bosnia are among the places you can visit from the comfort of your own home. Google's latest Street View update gave the company the opportunity to include imagery from about 80 more countries, which made this possible. 
This is one of the biggest expansions done on the service in recent years with access locations previously impossible or difficult to explore virtually being now accessed because of this. What strategies did Google use to achieve this success? They have developed a novel camera weighing only 15 pounds, which can easily be mounted on a vehicle. Due to this camera, Google has been able to access the less often visited and farther flung regions, capturing shots of inaccessible ancient monuments and breathtaking views inescapable before. This will make it possible to enjoy a larger number of hidden treasures, such as the Namibia sand dunes and Lonsang castles, among other wonders. Can you sometimes imagine exploring a town or country without leaving home or seeing new sites before you visit? Now you can completely immerse yourself in a vast range of places that are out of your reach. With this Street View update, users can explore malls, buildings, and tourist destinations in high detail, so virtual traveling will become even closer and more instantaneous than any real journey. Does Google Maps predict an ideal day for you? Generative artificial intelligence. Suppose that Google Maps have been able to suggest which restaurant would suit your budget or what things you could do indoors for a rainy day. Well, generative artificial intelligence has already been incorporated, which makes this the case today. The options you have and such factors as location and the weather are factored in by the artificial intelligence that is inserted into Google Maps. For example, if you have recently moved to a new city and find it's raining during the afternoon, Google Maps might suggest museums or other indoor activities nearby, which certainly simplifies planning for that day. Smart recommendations not only pertain to restaurants and tourism, but also encompass the entire spectrum of facets of your daily life so that you can live effectively and according to the situation at hand. This feature has been absolutely harmoniously integrated into the new card-style layout of the platform, which appears much more streamlined and user-friendly. With it, users do not have to waste interminable minutes to sift through search results, but are shown personalized choices in a streamlined, easy-to-understand format. How many times do you get lost in an area alien to you, wonder where to go or what to do? This new functionality, driven by artificial intelligence, removes the part of guesswork from the planning process since it gives suggestions that are smarter, faster, and more accurate modern look with better performance, at the same time that Google Maps and Earth have seen new features and capabilities added to their functionality, the company has also redesigned the structure of the applications themselves. This new layout based on cards provides the platform with a clearer and more orderly appearance that is much easier to navigate and use. The difference is so small that it really doesn't make sense except when thinking about the user experience, whether you are searching for a restaurant, planning a road trip, or researching environmental changes. Do you sometimes get too overwhelmed by too much information appearing on the screen? This new format lets users find things faster and with fewer distractions. It seems like a slight switch, but it's going to be really positive and hassle-free. Well, in certain regions, Google Maps and Earth have future perspectives to be changing all the time. What are the long-term Google goals with these tools? Now that artificial intelligence is evolving so fast, we can only imagine that all such future tools and functionality will be somehow more complicated and interesting. Will it ever be the moment when environmental predictions are done in real-time or AI simulation of how cities may grow in the future? These would, over time, prove most indispensable not only to casual users but also to experts operating in research, urban planning, and in the field of environmental science. The question is not if Google Maps and Earth can further develop, but how far they can go. With crossing of time, AI-powered search capabilities, and the ability to gain access to some of the most remote locations on Earth, the scope is limitless. Such changes that Google Maps and Earth have undergone offer new looks but bring along much more. They introduce new ways to explore the environment and historical facts, making more intelligent judgments with the help of artificial intelligence. It doesn't matter if you are an ecological researcher, if you are an urban planner, or if you are a curious traveler. These tools are now more powerful, easier to access, and more important than ever. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.